How do you defend yourself without breaking your hands? Aguila sent me a message on Instagram saying that he recently had a fight with some guys. He punched them a lot in the head, but after the fight, he saw my hand and uh, he saw his hand and broke some knuckles from the hits. Uh, now he's thinking never to punch again and uh, to only use palms. This is something very basic that I usually teach people even from the first classes. When you're fighting on the street, you don't want to use fists, um, you want to use palms. Now, before we uh, dive deeper into the subject, the most important idea is don't fight. Professional fighters don't fight on the street. Martial arts masters don't fight on the street. It's always a stupid idea. Now, if you need to defend yourself and you need to do something about it, it's good to have some kind of conditioning training prior to that. I actually uh, uploaded a video on this YouTube channel explaining how to use the wall bag to have stronger fists in case you need them. So go ahead and press the button right there and check it out. It's always better to use palms in a street fight. However, you should train your palms a bit before actually using them because guess what? If you hit something like this, then you're very likely to break your wrist and that's not going to be a good day so guys go ahead and check out the video on how you can use the wall bag to strengthen your hands so that you are better able to defend yourself in case you need it and let me ask you when was the last time you hit something very very hard and what did you hit now stay tuned because in the next video we'll be answering madalina's question on how you can have more time for meditation if you haven't subscribed already, be sure to do so and click the bell icon so that you get notified every time I post a new video on this channel. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to share it with a friend who has a very, very weak punch. I'll see you next time.